A new proposal from Turkey, Brazil and Iran's emerged in efforts to ease tensions over Tehran's nuclear program. But the United States is pushing back, with an eye on strategic interests more complex than the proposal itself. The United States has a need to talk to Iran over the Iraq issue and the overall need to strike the strategic balance in the Persian Gulf region. I'm Marla Dial, and this is Dispatch. The proposal announced Monday calls for Iran to ship low-enriched uranium to Turkey for safekeeping in return for more highly processed nuclear fuel to be sent within a year from Vienna Group countries. Turkey's involvement was a critical element. Turkey has been working very hard over the past several months to get close to Iran, to earn Iran's trust, and Turkey is a very crucial country in the region that the United States is looking to in helping stabilize uh, you know, the parts of the Islamic world that really do need it stabilizing right now. So Turkey is not an ally that the United States can easily ignore or reject in this proposal. The Obama administration was careful in its response, but essentially said no deal taking the risk that key powers in the U.N. Security Council will continue to complicate its calls for sanctions and that talks could drag on indefinitely. Washington's focus is on maintaining a balance of power rather than conceding Iranian power in the Middle East. But Tehran is viewing the same chessboard, and it's not going anywhere. Iran still has leverage in key points where the United States is heavily involved in places like Iraq and Afghanistan. So it can continue kind of being the thorn in the U.S.'s side for some time to come, even though it's uncomfortable with having the world's most powerful military on both sides of its borders. 